Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Siwa Karaki and in today's video, I will be playing with makeup. I really, it's like one of those, those things I've always wanted to learn how to do and I always bush it up, but I still rock it. So today I have a trusted friend who's going to just be the vocals. Like she's literally gonna guide me and direct me with what I should be doing from the first step to the last step. My name is Silva Karaki, this is my YouTube channel, and welcome and enjoy. <laughs> okay, now. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, I always hear a lot of makeup artists talking about, is putting on primer. So yeah. is that what we're doing first? That's what we're doing first. You just put a little, just a few drops on your forehead, cheeks, chin, just make sure that your whole face is covered with primer. Okay, and do you know why do you have to put primer? Primer is like the base of or the foundation on your face before you apply it. Before the foundation. Oh, so it's a foundation before the foundation? Okay, so I just... So you make your makeup set or be applied. You look, you look. Okay, now what do we do next? So I prefer to start with my brows first or my eyes. So we can start with, the, with your brows. So just take the pencil with your color. Okay, I have this pencil. I think this is the color dark chocolate brown okay and then what do i do just, just basically fill in your brows okay fill in the brows okay honestly the my favorite part when i do brows is concealer the cleaning part but i always really fuck it up like that's the part where i'm like oh I need help. it looks butchered <laughs> Okay, and then the other thing, just 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 a quick thought. I actually put on makeup now and again because I want to cover the dark spots that I have. So it's not really a train smash. I feel like I have good skin. I don't I don't really hate my skin. Because if I have breakouts, like you can see I have like a few breakouts here, they heal very easily. They just create dark marks. Like I have crazy dark marks. But so I we have the power of makeup to help us. Okay, so next what are we doing? So now I have this little thing called concealer and then this so this is the part where i okay why do you conceal your eyebrows basically you just shape and define them so okay you, you you fill them in but then you can just basically create the shape that you or just clean up okay perfect yeah so we just like let's see but so this is the this oh the bottom the bottom brow yeah and this is the part where you actually decide the shape that your eyebrow is. So this is where you most people fuck it up. Yeah. If you see like crazy brows, this is a but step. sometimes, you would have, when you use the pencil, you, you, you did it like a thicker thick brow. Thicker brow, thick oh, the, the size. Pencil. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so the underneath, and then I just... Yeah. Is this concealing? So light. Honey, light is good. They always say if your eyes light, yeah. you're creating a... So do I do the other on top or do I go on the other side? Okay, the bottom. bottom on the other side. Okay. When do you do the one where you like join like this? I mean, you can do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Dude. Dude, I'm already jumping steps, okay? Forgive me. Because this is already too light. White. <laughs> Please help me a bitch. I mean, uh, don't do that. Also, let me just also explain that I bought the makeup for this channel, for this video. Oh, I mean, for the video and for myself, because I want to learn a new skill. So imagine after buying a product and then she tells you, honey, <laughs> You bought for white people. This is what white people use. <laughs> so let's. Part of your brow, you use foundation and skin tone because it's going to be hard to. Because this on your eye, on your eye, you're also going to. You're going to cover it. So yeah. So we're gonna use this. This is why she's been wanting me to use the whole time. Just <laughs> by the way, uh, it is Remel 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 London. Remel London yes. Uh, and this is the color SPF. Imagine the color is SPF. No. <laughs> almond mahogany at the bottom. Mahogany. This is mahogany. This is the color mahogany, and it's a little pump thing. So do I just put it here? Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
guys. I'm, I'm on my kimonos. This is it looks dark-ish. Also red. Thank you. See. So now we're mixing the two colors. I f I definitely feel like a makeup artist now. Like legit. Okay. Okay. Also, now. We're gonna do the same thing where we also like almost paint it because now we're using foundation so we can yeah. all right so <laughs> what's that <laughs> you know i'm actually nervous now because i've tried this you can imagine i've tried this already before at home honey <laughs> and so this is the part where i usually fuck it up so then let's see Is it too high? Do I still need to go down? That's the end. Just yeah. Go down. Like you need to shape the brown if you want. Okay, can I find, can I borrow the small one up here? Because I can't see. Oh, okay. It definitely can get better. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think what is actually making it look a bit slightly weird is I need to clean out at the bottom. Can I already do that bottom part? Yeah. So I think I need to, like... Please tell me I'm going to be a great makeup artist. I mean, you will <laughs> definitely... I will get there. You will get there. How did you start to make... Like, how did your makeup journey start? Um, I don't know, I think I just bumped into like YouTube videos of people doing makeup and it's like, this is simple. Honey, this is a hot mess express. That is horrible. <laughs> okay, so let's do this. How about this eye? You, you, you. And I try to do that. And then we see the difference of when somebody else is doing it. But dude, threading is the worst. Mm -hmm. You? Was that again? Babes, I can't deal with threading. Oh, I see the difference. Especially at the edge of this one. Like, yeah. look at that edge. Look at this one, honey. Ooh. Hey, the guys out there who are trying to do this, you can clearly see it's difficult. So it's over time. Also, I feel like if you are artistic, like you need to be. Some people like with me, with makeup. I strongly feel that with some people, if you like generally like a good drawer or whatever, it makes it even easier and nicer. Okay, we've we've done our eyebrow. What do we do next? So now you need to blend because you can't let that foundation sit for a while. It's gonna be hard and then you can't. So you need to use the beauty blender. Okay. And just blend it out. Beauty blender. Oh, cool. All right, cool. So blending it out is what? Is do you literally rub and what do you tap? Okay, you. Tap on here. Okay. I mean, already I'm loving this mahogany and almond colors. The now, yeah. how the beauty? I love this girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Now, this is where you have your freedom yeah right? you do whatever you want so let me but now what do you do first also i love the cat eye thing so should we start with the eye no, like you do the what the, the liquid liner yeah no, you do that after you done with the, with the eyeshadow you can't do eyeshadow on top of the liquid liner but don't you if you do it on top doesn't it help like when you blend out or really that smokiness at the point at the edge because i'm liquid liner. oh okay Not okay so what do I do? How do I? What do I start? With? Oh, this is for the, for the eye, for the shadows, right? Yeah. So it just depends. I don't know. I normally, I, I, if I'm going for like a neutral nude look, I will do. I'll start with like a dark brown and then just put it all over my lid as a base and just blend it out. And then if I want to add a little bit of you know blush pink at the corner, so it's literally up to me. Okay, I already looked at cashmere. It's this one here at the. Oh, oh, 
my god I looked at cashmere at the end at the corner here and I really loved it so let's see how it actually applies so is there a trick to how to apply or is there a rule? so that's the first base of my cashmere and I just wanna wanted to pigment I don't know what this cosmetics is I'm living by fantasy! Okay. And then now I want to blend both the cashmere and the cosmo. So it's not so there. Okay. I look like a cloud now. First attempt of eyeshadow, that's cool. Okay, mm -hmm. The next step, so um you're gonna apply foundation. Are we done with the eye? Oh yes, you want your liquid hair from that? <laughs> Wait, I also want mascara. Oh yes. Okay, so mascara first or liquid first? Liquid. Yeah, liquid first. Girl, this girl wants to rob me. I mean, I was gonna do it at the end. <laughs> okay. I, f I actually don't know how to apply this. Like. Some say you, like, hold the front of your eye. This one's gonna be like, doing this. I know you do this, right? And then you go up, like you join there. Hey! Honey, this is, this is a hot mess express. I want to wipe this one more. And I'm using the beauty blender, which I'm still gonna. Next one is mascara. What's the trick with mascara? Do you know? I don't know. So, honey, she's got mascara for day. Oh, this is a shit mascara, though. It's like smudging everywhere. And now I'm putting on foundation and as you can see, I think I'm like the biggest influencer in the land. James Charles, hello! Too, but this thing doesn't even show like it doesn't show but the you color. do know that on the sides you do dark in the middle light yes i'm doing the sides at the moment mm -hmm. i actually can see this one yeah yeah okay, now 
now I'm preparing it up. Like just this few things I'm doing, I am looking different. Like I'm loving, like it's not even like proper makeup, but I just, I can, yeah. Okay, so I think I found applied my foundation fully. I've done also a. I really want to see how this would look if I also just mix it up with this. So, what brand do you suggest for like makeup? I would not be putting makeup every day. No yeah. way. <laughs> this is where I put this one. Yeah. And then I think it's a good idea to do those things. Like, and I, and it's therapeutic. I watch makeup tutorials. I enjoy them. I feel like I can see the highlights on the nose. Definitely, I like it there. More karki smudges everywhere. Keep my. Oh, there we go. If you worked corporately, like like when you we used to go to work, did you apply every day makeup? No, I do my brows, oh. so I can look awake. Because if I don't do my brows, I'm gonna be hey. What did you do? Did I mess it up? You messed it up. The thing is supposed to go on your skin, not on your makeup. Try to blend it with a beauty blender because lipsticks they come. And my efforts uh, highlighted they're gone. <laughs> yeah.
nose for me does it. Like I think once you get a nose right, it, it makes you feel yeah. like the like bond of bond. And I don't even think I have the nose right, but I'm just imagining what it, it was done really, really good. And I was done. I went to <laughs> I hope you did close the eyes. Yeah. So I'm gonna have a quick change of outfit. Not even change of outfit. Just to fix my hair and stuff. Yeah. And then I'll come back for the final reveal. <laughs> And there you have it. This is the final transformation. I really, really, really... You know what I can tell you, right? This is not proper, proper. But I could definitely leave the house to like lunch with a friend yeah. or like partying with this. It's not horrible. It's not, so I feel like over time, this can definitely get better and exciting. I've just realized that I definitely do not like a dark lip. Yeah. It makes me look like a smoker, like with the beard, like, <laughs> oh, not your vibe. definitely this is not it. Yeah. But let's get into the gig. Let's look at what we did. Also, I really, the eyeshadow does wonders. Like when once it's done right, I realize that eyeshadow is like, I don't know how I'm gonna edit this fucking